number five was the Zohar, and Genesis mentioned a fruit tree yielding fruit whose seed is in itself. Uh, this is also studied by Stan Tenen. What does this mean? The fruit tree and the fig tree were ancient uh, Hebrew understandings of the trees of life and of knowledge. Uh, the fruit tree being life and fig being uh, knowledge because, uh, as I wrote about in my essay on the uh, tables of the 8th and the ninth, uh, regarding fractal and mnemonic types of propagation, which are similar, uh, although the fractal uh, is exclusively self-replicating and uh, terminates into strange attractor uh, empty spaces, whereas the mnemonic is uh, exponential and uh, occurs in um, the growth patterns of plants. Uh, uh, the uh, fractal or fig pattern being related to the uh, tree of knowledge is essentially meaning the uh, tree of knowledge doesn't self-replicate um, in a permanent fashion. It's, it's uh, it branches off, but then uh, ends up spiraling into um, self-termination sooner than the mnemonic pattern, uh, which constitutes the mainstream uh, pattern of the propagation of living uh, or uh, living patterns and life forms. Um, so the fruit tree that bears that bears the seed within itself. Uh, is representing the tree of life or immortality uh, that would be symbolic of the mnemonic um, the mnemonic or uh, uh, phi, uh, phi spiral where is the uh, the reciprocal spiral uh, he asks um it would be the uh, the uh, mnemonic spiral would be the uh, phi spiral that would be based on uh, negentropic uh, order out of chaos and uh, the fig or uh, uh, tree of knowledge uh, or uh, fractal pattern would be based on uh, the pi spiral uh, and would be uh, a slower rate of self-replication and uh, ultimately terminate sooner. <laughs>